We just gotta like start taking out these guys. Focus on that one. Fire it up. And he's down. Got him. Get back up. Hmm, let's scan it. Deploys fresh outsiders. Okay, forget it then. We gotta kill this thing first. I can't aim. we have use a critical strike the gunship finish it off the only thing is I really don't have that many offensive abilities out of ammo What the? <laughs> what was he thinking? He hopped over. I punched him right in his face. There you go. Dropping off fresh ones. Take it down. This one's mine. Right, at least there's no one else behind us. Shit, it's right there. All right, we're getting it. We're getting it. Just got poured on. A doctor. Hit it hard. Healing engaged. Take it aim. Yeah, move. Get out the way, Lee Jones. Whoops, that's not cover. This is cover. Like, oh, I'm taking down this this gigantic gunship with a shotgun. I want to make it go over, but that's not happening right now. I also can't make it go around, so it's kind of worthless. I can't position it the way I need it. There you go. Killed outsiders. It's almost dead. Yes! Very scientifically advanced gunship taken down by an M14 rifle. See you in hell. Hit it hard. Take it shot. All right, defeat the remaining aliens. Well, I'm basically out of ammo. Now I am. I'm fading fast over here. Focus on that target. Any ammo lying around? Doesn't look like there's any. I'll heal. There's no more enemies. Oh, here we go. This is uh the loop. All loops back on this. Jones, what are you doing? Where is he? I got him. Get up. Get up, Tommy Lee Jones. You might be old, but you're not out of the fight yet. Finish it off. Focus on that one. Nice. Good work. 
Good work, XCOM. Well done, Carter. Well done. Barnes, if you're in the neighborhood, we could use a lift. Roger that. Let's get the hell out of here. Thank you, Agent Carter. I never would have made it out of here without Wait, he was fighting? I didn't even know. Without Lawrence. Alright, we did it. Several civilians discovered the area of operation were under effect of a previously unknown mind-altering pathogen codenamed Sleepwalker. The pathogen is presumed to be one of extraterrestrial origin. The affected civilians have been brought to the lab for study. Dr. Weir was recovered safely and appe appears to be unaffected by the pathogen. Other civilians unaffected by the pathogen remain on site and may pose a security risk. Cleanup crews are advised to use discretion dealing with uninfected survivors. Alright, I almost hit level 3. And Bryant doing a decent amount of work. Jones basically laying down support. Alright, good stuff. Killed 47 outsiders. How much longer can the invasion be kept secret? Agent Carter returns from Georgia with Dr. Alan Weir safely recovered. There are easier ways to give up smoking, I'm told. I came here to ask for your help. Okay. We have several situations that require a senior agent, but with De Silva already in the field and me tied to a desk and Nils... Dead. Well, you're the only one I can trust with this. Just go to Ops and access the map. Do I have a choice? Not really. Glad to help out. Alright, where's my hat? I lost my hat. Here's a photo. Pima, New Mexico. I lost my hat! Oh, wait, there it is. I can't grab it, though. Keep a well stocked roster. You can lose the game if all your agents die. I heard the same speech you did. The report from Georgia was pretty grim. At least you were able to bring back a few survivors. All right, we rescue who we could. It's bad out there. We rescued who we could, but it was too late for most of them. You mean those sleepwalkers? The labs don't have a clue about how that started, or how to fix them. All right, poor bastards. What if there's no cure for them? If they're just stuck reliving the same moment over and over again? Trapped in their own head. Can't think of much worse than that. Let's hope there's a cure then. All right, what's your target? Any intel on the outsider commander? Somebody's got to be leading this invasion, right? You mean Axis? Yes and no. But let's just keep that between you and me. It's... complicated. Well, that's cryptic. Anyone could be listening in. And I've been tracking this case for too long to risk losing it now. Right. What do you think about Falk's paranoia? Is Falk getting too paranoid? Well, no. That depends. Depends on what? <laughs> Whether or not Falk's listening right now. <laughs> That's actually a good answer. Are you more worried about infiltrators? We've already had one infiltrator. Think we've got more? Heinrich says they're working on a test, but we've already got the monster that tried to blow us up. I say we just pry the information out of his head. That might be why you're not allowed to interrogate him. You didn't know his victims like we did. Knowing he was walking around the base, watching us for who knows how long, you'd want him dead too. All right, that's it. I'm going to get some answers. Good luck. Get some answers from where? Mission selection. Alright, we have a whole bunch of stuff. View intel from across the country and send agents or send agents on dispatch assignments. Oh, those are nothing. Okay. Nevada, rumbles of terror, news from the front. Receiving reports of devastating earthquakes in the San Francisco area. The damaged infrastructure and remaining fires in the major naval port has cost 82 lives and damaged one of our battleships, the USS North Carolina. Our analysts theorize 
uh, that the seismic activity may be the result of more outsider terraforming along the San Andreas fault line. Operation Code Breakers. This is that DLC one. There's this. Operation Guardian. Operation Grifter. So these are the three missions I can do. A weapons launch, retrieval, or the DLC. So I think we should do the uh, the weapons launch. All right, we have access to new equipment. I think maybe we should uh, leave Jones here. What do some of the other people have? Like what, is, what does Eastwood have? Combat stims. Shield sphere. Protecting all inside against enemy fire. Disrupt and weaken. Destroys an enemy's armor and makes them and renders them vulnerable. Significantly reduce damage when given a, on a revive order. Significantly increases the entire squad's bleed out time. Uh, maybe I'll take Eastwood. What do you think? Yeah, let's take Clint. Whoops. He replaced uh, Brian, which I didn't want. Keep Brian. What abilities does he get? Cloak, Diversion, I'm taking Cloak. Crack Shot, recharges Critical Strike faster. Critical Strike now does heavy damage to armor and shields. Bombards the area, okay. I'll keep him with me because I remember the other guy was really good too. Let's, uh, let's give him better equipment. Ah, oh, that's it? He can only use machine pistols? Well, that sucks. Alright, let's do this one. Begin the mission. Swap out Tommy Lee Jones for uh, Clint Eastwood. A nuclear launch code has been issued from Silo 6, a hidden military f uh, missile facility. Ensure that the missile does not launch. Make sure that Site 6 remains disarmed. Anything less risks starting a nuclear war in the middle of an alien invasion. So let me get this straight. A nuclear launch code was issued to a secret facility located here. But the bomb never launched. Thankfully. And we're here to find out what went wrong. Or what went right. Nothing's what it seems anymore. Alright, let's go. Crash plane. What do we have? Some outsiders? Just a couple of outsiders, nothing much. Let's take out this one. Make him hurt. Keep your head down. Clint Eastwood. Drawing a bead on it. Boom! Instant kill. He's pushing us. Oh, he instantly downed Brian. Oh, he instantly downed me. 
Bye, Brian. Agent down.